on board together. So this is something that you both need to be um, focused on and kind of be moving towards in the same direction. So it's it's not just his job that that you're going to support or um, you've got your thing and he's got his thing and you just kind of catch up at the end of the day. It's actually something that you both need to kind of be headed towards and be partners in. Um, but what that actually looks like on the ground might be different because of your situation and stage of life and that kind mm. of thing. Mm. And you've got to keep wrestling with that. But I think it's impo important that you're both see yourselves in partnership together kind of um, doing this thing. Um, I would say use every opportunity that you have if you're moving into a new area um, yeah try and see and get into the community around you so um, yeah Google what where kids go and what they do and see what the libraries are doing and uh, community events and you know whatever interests you have try and join teams or clubs or just to get to know the people in the community you know who you are who the people are you're trying to reach and it's a unique opportunity that you know you've moved into an area and you can say I'm new to the area you know where will I find this or mm. where should I go for this or yeah um, so use every opportunity you can um, and it's, and just, I guess, have patience that it's building relationships takes time. Um, things won't change overnight or necessarily be get better overnight. But if you just keep plugging away, keep uh, trusting in Jesus, keep seeking to know His Word and know His will, and just keep trusting in Him and keep doing what you know uh, will help bring people into the kingdom. And yeah, it'll. God will use you in all sorts of different ways. So, um, help your wife feel like she's involved. I think um, there can be a tendency to feel like times can get so busy and hectic that all he might want to do is come home and just rest and kind of switch off, which is important. But then I think sometimes as a wife you can feel like you've had a big day of whatever you're doing and you're actually really chafing at the bit to kind of find out what's been happening with church, you know, what decisions have been made or, you know, what's kind of coming up and sometimes you can feel like you get, you don't get to be a part of that because you get the tired part of your husband or the, um, yeah, so then, I mean, you've got to work out what that looks like but I feel like it's important that the wife continues to feel like she's in that partnership. Um, yeah, because well, I think when you start to feel like you're not actually in that partnership anymore, um, you can start to resent um, church, you can start to resent things like moving away from family and friends and support networks and all that kind of stuff. Um, and so yeah, it's important to continue to realise that it is a partnership together, that mm. it's, yeah, you've got to keep walking together in that. <laughs>